I watched a beautiful film uh, just yesterday. And Jesse, I saw film. Ko dekha, wo film finish hui. The first thing that I did was message uh, Tapsi that this is an yeah. awesome film because uh, this is the perfect film for a person who's sitting at home, probably is not in a good mood. And the colors of this film and the speed of this film and what is trying to tell you, everything like sums up to give you a great attitude towards life. Tapsi, director Akash, and Tahir Raj Basin. Hello and welcome. Hi, hi. Hi, thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much, Atika. Tapsi, mere ko ye bata do. Kitna doro bhi aap? Bas iske baad nahi. Bas ho gaya. Jitna doro sa kisi doro li is picture ke liye. So, um, in my college years, there was this film called Run, Lola, Run. It was a German film, very famous in those times because it's because of its technique. एक ही सिचुएशन एंड देन दैट एंड देन आफ्टर दैट इस टेक्निक को हमने कई और हिंदी फिल्म्स में भी देखा कि अगर एक ही सिचुएशन को तीन बार जिया जाए तो उसके कैसे आउटकम्स अलग हो सकते हैं तापसी व्हेन यू हैव टू डू वन सीन थ्राइस ओवर एक ही चीज को तीन बार करना है एंड जस्ट द राइट अमाउंट ऑफ चेंज एंड डिफरेंट टोनल क्वालिटी ऑल्सो हैज टू बी देयर हाउ डू यू अटेम्प्ट दैट दैट इज द द बेस्ट एंड द वर्स्ट part about this film best because you know that's uh, what an actor will enjoy doing worst because it is very difficult yeah be it uh, it's not just ke the situation has changed it i have to keep in mind what happened the first time around when i'm doing the second time yeah and and also things have happened differently in the second time so i have to keep that also uh, emotional continuity in mind and mm. then you do the third one keeping in mind what happened the first time and the second time and the things that have happened there and how you began the third one which what mind frame you're coming with into the third loop so uh, there was a lot to uh, process every time uh, i attempted a scene and we have to do it three times over in the same location be it a basic run of 50 meters it was supposed to be done in a different way the body language had to be different to your emotional emotion had to be different because some something different has happened in every loop when i've reached a certain uh, juncture so hence it became the best and the worst uh, part for both uh, probably me and akash as well we enjoyed discovering uh, something new for every loop but at the same time you know it it, it gets like oh shit shouldn't we kuch bhul to nahi gaye कुछ ऐसा जो मतलब जो वो दिमाग में रखना भूल तो नहीं गए जो चीज हुई थी सो इट वॉज क्वाइट अ माइंड बेंडर टू डू द सेम थिंग इन थ्री डिफरेंट वेज एंड दैट एंड शी इज ओनली कैरेक्टर हु नोज वॉट इज हैपन सो या सो दैट्स वॉट देर सो मच टू कीप इन माइंड इस फिल्म की स्क्रिप्ट अगर हाथ में आए और शुरू से आप इसको पढ़ना शुरू करें तो इट्स लाइक novel and tak padni zaruri hai it's like a jeffrey archer's sydney sheldon a kind of a novel i had uh, always been a fan of run lola run jaise ki aapne kaha hum sabne matlab college ke time mein ye film dekhi hui thi and was fascinated at the concept aur kabhi maine apne sapne mein bhi nahi socha tha ki jab ye hindustan mein banegi i would get to play a manny's part so that was definitely something that attracted me to it the fact that tapsi was on board because i've been watching all her films for the past few years and she's doing yeah. fantastic work yeah. and um <laughs> once i got involved in the process to know that technically how different and and you understand very quickly within 4 days i understood that this is going to be a very different looking film <laughs> thanks to the crew that akash had had put together so yeah. these were the the three basic um, uh, instincts that wow black like, like, i mean pun unintended uh, and uh, of course like how you mentioned ki jab script aap padhna shuru करते हैं तो इट्स लाइक अ बंच ऑफ शॉर्ट स्टोरीज दैट इवेंचुअली हैव अ पे ऑफ इन द एंडिंग और खूबसूरती ये है कि वो एक ही हादसा आप तीन बारी देखेंगे पर हर बारी आपके देखने का नजरिया बस थोड़ा सा बदल जाएगा सत्या की खूबसूरती इस कहानी में मेरे लिए ये थी कि वो नहीं जानता कि ये हादसा तीन बारी मतलब मतलब एक बारी दोबारा हो रहा है और उसके बाद तीसरी बार हो रहा है सो हाउ डज ही रिएक्ट एज द कैरेक्टर एंड मी मी एज अ पर्सन एज द एक्टर प्लेइंग सत्या नोइंग व्हाट इज ऑन द ऑन द स्क्रिप्ट हाउ टू do those things for the second time for the third time but do them just a little bit differently so that you yeah. remain entertained and right. um, and and i love the way satya the way satya was written where he's um, <laughs> unintentionally uh, funny like wo jis tarah hai bas wo vulnerable hai funny hai i know i love that scene uh, jisme aap ek jewelry store ko 
I don't know kitna spoilers mein de sakti hu, but I just want to give the right amount of information to the viewers so that they actually uh, anticipate and they they know what we're talking about. The scene where you come out of the jewelry store after robbing and then you're doing this, and the owner thinks that you're dancing. Ye mere ko loot ke naach raha hai. Kaise? That is such a lovely scene. Lovely scene. Yeah, yeah. um, so all these, uh, uh, th th this kind of humor is something that we had been missing. Uh, in the in the recent uh, in the recent past akash mujhe bataiye cinematographer kaun hai aur edit kisne ki hai uh, film ke cinematographer hai yash khanna um, wow. this is his first feature film in and i have worked with both of them in advertising for a very very long time we have had a good uh, working relationship and this is our, our combined first feature film Great, great. So kudos to the people who are behind the technique of the film because the technique of the narrative is what kept me totally, you know, on the edge of the seat. Tapsi, I'm looking at the color of your top. And this is just the color that we need right now. We need some positive, colorful colors. And this is exactly also one of the points of the film that is the USP. Colors are so beautiful. It's like every scene has been shot in a casino or in a disco or in a, you know, it's just fluorescent lights everywhere. So this is also one of the reasons why the movie looks very nice. So you, the, the person watching it ends up feeling very nice. Um, Akash, uh, so ye film kaha set karni hai? Is ka treatment kaise rakna hai? The colors that you wanted to use and, and how you adapted it to the Indian audiences. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, in terms of just the way the film's been, the visual landscape of the film comes from the, again, the storytelling that we wanted to do. It's a world building exercise. This film exists because it's a film. We wanted to treat it with with that with that knowledge and with that sort of conscious self awareness. You know, uh, we wanted to treat it like a comic book. We wanted it to look exciting, feel exciting, oh, because all the yeah. all all the, all the characters are sort of in a graphic novel. You know, right? right. Uh, and and, and it, it 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 is exaggerated in some scenes. It's not exaggerated in some. We hold us, ourselves back and then we let go. So I mean, that sort of a treatment was something that I wanted to um, uh, do and all the other stakeholders that came in on the film, whether it's the actors, whether it's the producer, they were all very happy because the original also has done, had done something uh, mind bending for the time it was made. Yeah. I mean, and if, if, if you are adapting a film, the least you could do is bring freshness to it and in your own authorship. And that's something that was very important to us as for making it for the Indian sort of audience. I think that goes without saying uh, when you're making a film about the people who, who are going to watch it, you have to make it about them in some, and, and yeah. their sensibilities and their, their, their sort of sentiments and whatnot. Um, it's set in a version of Goa. Uh, we never explicitly call it that, but it's set in a version of Goa because again, like I said, it's the idea is to build a world that exists yeah. in this film, you know, because nothing is real, but everything is in an authentic manner, you know? Yeah. Um, and, and yeah, and that was, that was something that we were very certain of from the, from the day we uh, got on uh, to the pre-production of the film. And immense amount of shot taking. How much footage did you get out of the shoot? I, please, I please ask like, the actors this question also, allow us to speak. <laughs> <laughs> oh God. How, how much did you shoot Tapsi and uh, Tahir? Uh, I don't want to revisit Wait, the memory. Let me match this frame. Wait, let me match this frame. <laughs> oh. Yeah. oh God, that was what. It's about. I camera कहीं पे भी जा रहा है. मतलब एक पत्थर. मतलब मेरा अगर मैंने phone उठाया तो there's a camera rigged to my arm. Yes, yes. And अगर मैंने eat fag किया there's a camera rigged to the eat. Yeah. The patthar packed with the camera zip to a patthar. I'm like, oh my god, the point of views of this film are like crazy. So, I mean, after one point, we said that it's a rig veda. It's like a rig veda. Because it's such a rig. And I mean, the kind of shots that they have envisioned of, you know, there is a sequence in the, in the film uh, where I cross one road and then cross the second road and then bump into a car and then yeah. roll on the bonnet and go down that's all done in a single shot and then, and yeah. i'm the one running and there is the people exchanging hands uh you know camera but wo ek single shot mein chalte hi ja hai. so wo jis ke shots and and they were like nee, ek hi take mein i mean ek hi shot hoga ye mm -hmm. bhagwan bachaye, abhi to kitne take lagenge iske andar. and that too like i have to do it for multiple runs 
so uh, I, I, like that we had a lot of those moments where i was like the point of view khatam nahi ho rahe is is uh, scene ke to but then that was the treatment that uh, akash had decided decided from the beginning it's going to have and that's why probably it looks the way it looks because it had those new camera angles and the new rig types of rigs to the new style of shot taking so when you you getting into that zone you should get it like get into it unconditionally then i i guess we surrendered to it after a point but it was uh, exhausting for everyone to actually go through it uh, now we can like it enjoy enjoy it and all but when you we were doing that process it was very challenging for everyone i'm sure it was for uh, akash also to to make sure he gets that shot right you conceive to kar liya but wo execute karne mein waisa hoga ke nahi hoga it's quite uh, frustrating sometimes when you're not really getting it the way you've envisioned it yeah no 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 yeah, and just to just to um, add to what what tapsi was saying it was for for me it was an acting challenge because the kind of films that i had been on before um it, it, you have the novelty of getting on set uh, the director will give you their brief they will ask you how you want to do it you will block the scene and then the technology comes in and they will light and frame according to how the actor wants to do it um akash works the other way around he comes from a very technically heavy uh, background and 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 that was a learning for me for me it was it, it was overcoming uh, that mindset that i had gotten used to and overcoming that hurdle and it was an experience it was a learning and when you see the product like that stuff you were saying when you see it you understand why that that vision and why that that world of thinking and 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 now in hindsight it it is it seems like yes it was not an exercise in futility and it and it has a definite payoff yeah yeah amazing amazing i'm again telling the viewers guys don't miss this movie because it's actually a very different experience um you'll be very proud i was very proud of having watched this film maine kaha chalo yaar kuch to naya hai matlab aur aisa kaisa naya hai bahut naya hai in terms and of experience full, full, full talking, everything everything and tapsi what else do we look forward to from your kitty every time you come out with a project it just surprises us Rashmi Rocket was was so bold. It was so uh, physically a bold film. You know, this one is you know, this one is mentally so experimental. You know, it just just takes you to different world all all together. What is is there any pattern to which uh, is is there a pattern to the way you're choosing films? What what's uh, driving you uh, in this phase? Um, that only that what is different? What is new? What is something that I haven't seen before as an audience on screen? um especially in hindi films so i think like an audience before i say yes to a film so hence i end up picking uh, the stuff that i would want to watch as an audience i would want to spend my time and money on and i feel agar main kar sakti hu to i i am like a you know a regular audience when i go watch a film so main kar main mere ko dekhne ka mann hai to i believe kafi aur ka bhi hoga if it uh, turns out to be the way i imagine it will when i hear a script so hence uh, at the same process of choosing something the bar is going to just get uh, will be pushed higher in the sense that i want the the scope and scale of the film to start growing every year uh, so then hence the risk taking capacity slowly keeps increasing so there is you know a, a, a particular scale of a, of films that i can pull off as an actor uh, you know as someone who wants to attach herself to films which are of a certain scale and then you push it further for the next year so the risk factor increases the expectation factors also increases uh, then it becomes challenging and fun otherwise you when you come into the comfort zone it's not fun it, it, then you just get bored and your audience gets bored after some time hmm. but you know i asked this question to shahid a couple of days ago and i asked him ki aaj ke daur mein the world is changing very dynamically social media or just how the world moves ahead you know is changing the way the consumers uh change as uh, in terms of what they want to consume there was a time when actors used to be booked for two years in a row three years in a row how much do you keep yourself kind of uh, booked in advance for the next few years i try i mean i try not to book myself more than a year that's what i've been trying to do last uh, two years at least I mean, वो ज़्यादा हो रहा है because of lockdown, because things get pushed. But in ideal case, like right now, I probably will not take up films before uh, you know the first quarter of uh, the next year because I want to finish the kind of films I've said yes to already. 
so i'll mm-hmm. not say yes until you know we progress two three months further down and then i'll take up something new so ek saal se zyada i try to not book myself because you you want to see how it's changing right how mm-hmm. are the how what kind of films are coming what kind of films are uh, what is the response of the films that are coming out of your own like matlab tumhari film ka result kaisa hai audience ko kya pasand aaya kya nahi aaya and uh, currently us time pe kis tarah ki filme ban rahi hain is there something something relevant and current that has come in that you want to uh, address and talk about soon so uh, so all this so that's why i i try to keep it within a year great amazing guys thank you so much for doing this film loop lapeta so loop Thank is you. because the movie is on a loop and lapeta means loop ke lapete mein aap mat aa jayega there is something very interesting going to happen in the end so i realized it was the movie was over a great job great script great treatment everything i mean kudos to the entire team of Thank lapeta you. looking forward thank you thank you thank so you. much thank you very much